Teachers of Christian Methodist Senior High School, we used to call it Krimeto, um, in, in uh, New Aplaco, in the Greater Accra region, have allegedly been attacked and stoned by some students of the school. Now, the teachers say they were attacked because they did not allow the students to cheat during the West African Senior Secondary Certificate Examination that was yesterday. So guess what? The video you're seeing there are the students, angry students, just chasing the teachers and pelting them with stones and, and sachet water bags. Uh, and the teachers had to run for their dear lives. It's worrying to say the least. And this is not the first time we've seen this. Um, in some previous instances, this, during the same WASI, we, uh, in the Bright Senior High School in the Eastern region, we saw similar instances. And so th this, is, this is really reminding, especially those who have been watching this space about what exactly is, is going on. And this is here in the Greater Accra region. And, um, well, that's Crimeto students you see there. And, uh, well, the, 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 the gentleman we are circling in the red circle, that's the teacher, Walter Yesuto Adanunyo. He just, just unfortunately had to just run for his dear life. Guess what? Walter Yesuto Adanunyo is joining us on Zoom right now. Walter, thank you. Thank you so much for joining us here on Ghana tonight. Um, really, we, we bear with you in the ordeal and what we saw in that video. But, but tell us, what, what exactly happened? Actually, in the video, the, especially the visual art students completed um, their WASI exam uh, on 16th, which is Monday, and uh, the paper was um, Integrated Science. After the uh, General Science, we were we were after the the paper was was taken out of the school. I was in the school with my HOD. He also invigilated. And then the one of the students came back. She was going home. And then when she reached the gate and saw the mob there, she came back and came to tell him that the students say that they would have to hurt me, me in particular, Walter in particular, because uh, I've actually not done anything to them, but they believe they have to hurt me. I am too strict in the exam room. That is what they think uh, they want to do. So when the girl came to tell us, we called a uh, headmaster, assistant headmaster academics. We called him, and then he he also called the police patrol team. So they came. They came around, and then they came to sack those students in the school, those who were on the on the compound, because after them. All the papers were taken away from the compound, and then uh, we, we were done with the day's business. So nobody was supposed to be in school, and they were at the gate. The same way, the yesterday the police were not around. They said they were at um, the uh, the demonstration where the demonstration took place. So they they didn't come. So the boys, the area guys, were the people who shielded us. And then they were taking us to the roadside again. Then these school boys threw water, pure water at them. So the moment the, the pure water hit them, they got annoyed. And then they went back chasing the boys. Then I told them that oh, they should leave them and let's go. So they left them. And then when we were going, they started throwing stones at them. That was the last straw that broke the camel's back. They went back looking for anybody in school uniform to beat. I don't know whether they caught, they caught somebody, but they went after them, ran after them. And then when they ran after them, we were left alone. The teachers were left alone. We were three permanent teachers and two service personnel. So we, I told them that, okay, so since the attention is there, let's try and go. Not knowing some of the students, because they are many than us, use other routes. And then they... They met us halfway the journey to the roadside. 
that was when they started that hey, I am I am straight in exam room. I don't want anybody to copy. Why will I will I not allow them to cheat in the exam room? You can plainly say that, see that the target was me because they, they voiced it out. There were other other people who were uh, passing uh, by uh, with and, cars, and I say and they stopped. Uh, yeah. To find well, Sad one, water, and the video we're seeing. So, like, clearly, this was an ambush, sort of, the way you're describing it. So, have any of the students been arrested as yet? So, I learned uh, police came around and picked four of them. I don't know if they were the people uh, in my statement, which I gave at the police station. <laughs> I doubt, but I wrote their names. If you want me to give their names to you, I can give their names to you off head. They are students, I thought. About six of them. Well, and um, I know you, as you have gone to report this to the police, and obviously you, you know them. You say they are your students, so you could identify them. When you're saying four of them have been picked up. There's one that will stay the steam on uh, to see what happens next. Uh, but I, I thank you uh, for even getting the strength to speak to us. Walter Yesuto Adanunyo is the teacher at the Christian Methodist Senior High School who unfortunately was at the receiving end of some indiscipline on the part of the students who say he did not allow them to cheat in the exam hall yesterday during the ongoing WASI paper that they wrote yesterday.